Ever since I was a little kid, when I first saw that Paramount picture symbol intertwining with a mountain, and Indiana Jones walking in front of that, that scene right there, I just wanted to travel. I wanted to explore. It just impelled me and changed me forever in my life. And it's, it's just strange how one movie can do that. But it's one of the main reasons why I love to travel. And I want to travel and see the world and experience it now. Not when I get older and retired and not being able to eat what I want or go anywhere, go anywhere I want to. Now, now is the time. And that's just me. Also, due to life and circumstances that happen in my life and others' lives, no naming names, <laughs> but no hate for anybody. Just this is what it is and this is what life is. And this is my life right now. And to want to take a chance and go travel and spend a lot of money when you don't have a lot of money, but to see the world, to taste the food, to try different drinks, to meet different people, just to see that other people live lives across the world and we all have our problems, but we all care about each other. And I think traveling to different places shows me that, shows me that we all can live and try to live as best as possible and just be comforted by one another. That's why I like traveling also. So I made it to London, all right, and I'm at the British Museum. Big and beautiful. So I'm gonna be looking in there at all the pretty art. Talk to you later, bye. So I'm in the Great Hall in the British Museum, and it's a really gorgeous place. Awesome. Very cool. So I'm in the British Museum in the Egyptian part. Lots of good art here. Lots of fascinating things here. Rad. Back in the beautiful cemetery in London. It is so beautiful. Especially during the springtime. It's amazing. So nice. Very cool. In Manchester, England, so much to answer for. It's gonna be a pretty interesting day for me. So, here we go, here's a little scene. Kind of busy. Daily life in Manchester. We'll see where it takes me. Ciao. Hello. So I'm in the uh, city of Nottingham where Robin Hood is from. I'm gonna go take a look and see if that legend lives up to its own legend. And maybe have a pint at the, supposed to be the oldest pub in England, supposedly. So I'll keep you informed. See you in a minute, bye. Well, I'm in Nottingham and I drank a lot. <laughs> at the old Jerusalem Yude pub that's been there for uh, 1189 so I was gonna do a tour of the Nottingham Castle but now I'm gonna ride back to London right now but here's a statue of Robin Hood right there awesome very cool Nottingham is actually a really nice town had a good time here, but now I must go home or back to my hotel and pass out because a lot of good ales. Bye-bye. In the uh, White Cliffs of Dover, look how pretty that is. Very nice. Wish you were here. Bye. Oh, 
someone is feeding the seals and doing a good job at it. Rad. Look at all these guys. That is crazy. Whoa. Now we're getting all pissed off. Oh my god. So bad. So in Paris, France now, and my room is actually cool. It's small, but it's cute. There's the shower going there. Very cute. And then uh, my room is right here. Small, but very efficient for European um, room in France, Paris. And my view is right here of downtown. So we're gonna be visiting uh, the Cien Wit River tonight, and uh, we'll get we'll get a nighttime view of the Eiffel Tower. We'll have the tour tomorrow, so I'm excited for that, and the Louvre and Notre Dame. So we'll get back to you tomorrow. C'est la vie. In the middle of France, right now, really, really crazy and busy. My uh, friend Cal, say hello. Hi. From New uh, New Zealand. Very cool, yeah. Middle Earth. From down under. <laughs> down under, there you go. Look how crazy it is. It is just insane here. Very cool, more later. Eating in a cafe in Paris, France. Uh, pretty busy. Craziness around. I'll get back to you. Okay, you think Tijuana and London is bad with traffic? No. Paris is beyond that. You're fucking crazy here. It's just insane. I don't know how people don't get killed. They are insane drivers here. I would never ever drive here. A hundred times worse than, uh, than London. Do you believe that? Crazy. Hello. 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 We're in another video going along the uh, Seine River here in Paris, France. So it should be a lot of fun. I'll take a lot of pictures. C'est la vie. I'm gonna see it tomorrow and I'll probably only see it like 1% because it is freaking huge as you will see after the bridge right here. It is just immense. Full side right here. It's just one side of the loop. In the 13th century, this was the fortress of the kings of France. Crazy. People just kicking back in the Cyan River right here. Having a nice spring night. 8.45 at night. Still light. Paris nightlife is about to happen. Le Pont Neuf est le plus ancien pont de Everybody's saying hi. It's very cool. It's Notre Dame. Freaking awesome. Amazing. Look at that. That's just awesome. It is symbolic of the Gothic period, along with the cathedrals of Chartres, Amiens, and Rennes. Nuestra Señora de París fue construida para el obispo Maurice de Chuy por el genial arquitecto Pilar Torrejón. La catedral fue terminada en 1330, como las catedrales de Chartres, Amiens, a 
Babor, hôtel des Invalides. Cet hôtel de Mansart abrite aujourd'hui le tombeau de Napoléon et le musée de l'armée. Le dôme, redoré récemment, constitue une des belles curiosités de Paris. To port the Esplanade and the Hotel des Invalides. It was built by Mansart and now houses the Volumes 2 and the Army Museum. The dome reaches a height of 107 meters. A Babor, la Esplanada y el Palacio de los Inválidos. El Palacio de los Inválidos alberga la tumba de Napoleón y el Museo de las Fuerzas Armadas, la Iglesia de los Inválidos. Aussitôt après ce pont à Tribord, le Musée d'Art Moderne et la statue de Boulevard en français libre. In front of you, the Pont de l'Alma, with its soir, against which flood tide measurements are taken. Just after the bridge, to starboard, the Museum of Modern Art, Bordeaux. Après celui de Citroën, en 1925, est un émetteur encore actif depuis la guerre de 14. To port the Eiffel Tower, it was created at the turn of the century by the engineer Gustave Eiffel for the Universal Exhibition. This three-story metallic assembly, with its ingenious lighting, which took over from Citroën in 1925, has been used as a broadcast plan since 1914. Fue diseñada y concebida para la exposición universal de principios de siglo por el ingeniero Gustavo Eiffel. Actualmente es el There it is, the Statue, the Statue of Liberty. The Eiffel Tower, you'll see it more tomorrow. Be on top of that baby tomorrow. Nice. Here's the Eiffel Tower sparkling for about five minutes. Very, very cool. Love it. Here's the Eiffel Tower sparkling for about five minutes. Very, very cool. Love it. Looking at Notre Dame. Here you go. I'll have more. Bye. Going to go on an elevator up at the Eiffel Tower, which is probably a little scary knowing you know me, but uh, should be a lot of fun. I'll show you when we're up there. Bye. I made it, and Cal made it too up here. <laughs> I was a little freaked, but I'm good. But here's the view there, Jen. We are only on the second level, and here's the top level. I'm staying here. Bye bye. Going to see Mona Lisa, but she got a lot of good stuff here. Lots of crazy, nice, beautiful stuff. We're at the Louvre, and it is beyond amazing here. Just way too much to look at. Right, Cal? Way too much to look at. Oh yeah. Crazy.